Hi there! Here's the newly launched 55 inch 4K Sony Bravia X90L. This is a 2023 variant of the X90 series. It comes with full array backlight, 120Hz refresh rate, VRR, and LLM support, which makes it perfect for, you guessed it, PS5 gaming. To put it in simple terms, this TV is designed for PS5 with now a dedicated gaming menu. It's so cool. Surprise, surprise, we actually bought one along with this TV. The best part, Sony is currently offering a combo deal with the X90L where you can get a discount up to 24,000 if you buy both of these together. Something you shouldn't miss out on. We'll also give you a sneak peek at the PS5 gaming experience, so stay tuned. The X90L goes full throttle when it comes to features and viewing experience. XR Triluminous Pro, Acoustic Multi Audio, the Bravia Core app that comes pre-installed from where you can stream IMAX enhanced content directly on this TV. It's amazing. So without further ado, let's quickly unbox both these devices and dive straight in. Let's begin. So here is the retail box packaging of the X90L. The usual brown box with some of its key features mentioned below. On the side, we can see the contents of the box, some manufacturing details and the MRP of 1,69,900. So you don't have to unbox this TV yourself. Sony will be sending a technician to your doorstep who will set it up for you or even wall mount the TV if needed at no extra cost. So here's everything that you get inside the box. Let's start with the paperwork. There's the safety and other information. Then you have the setup guide. Then you have the warranty card. You have the reference guide. And here is the list of service stations in India. Really, really helpful. Then you have some screws to wall mount the TV. Here's the power cable, two metal stands. And the quality of the stands is next level. One of my favorite part of Sony Bravia TVs, super quality stands, fully metal, the top part, the bottom part, and it's got this really nice design, which doesn't attract any fingerprint or smudges. There's rubber at the base, so it should provide a good grip on the table as well. Then you have two AAA batteries for the remote, and finally, the all new Sony Bravia remote. Now we've seen this design in most Sony TVs of late, very simple, clean, and easy to use. You can see the D-pad to navigate, TV button, settings button, input button, Google assistant button, volume up and down, settings button. We have shortcut keys for Netflix, YouTube, and there are two new ones, Bravia Core and Sony Live. Really nice, simple, and convenient to use remote. One of the best parts of this TV have to be the stand. Just push it in and the lock on its own. Just perfect. Then we also unbox the PS5, though we aren't going much into detail about the contents because most of you have probably already seen it. But just for your information, we got the disc variant which comes with one DualSense controller. More about the gaming experience further in the video. So we have fixed the stands and table mount the TV. It comes with this cardboard on the front to prevent the display from any kind of damage during transportation. Now if you have noticed, we have raised the TV stands a little higher so we could place a soundbar in front without blocking the screen. By default, it will be a lot lower, but Sony gives us an option to raise them for a situation like this. By the way, this is the Sony S2000 soundbar and a separate review video of this to follow soon. Make sure you're subscribed. Coming back, the frame is perfectly flat, which looks very clean and at the same time, super futuristic. This is the frame from the previous X90K and this gray one is from the X90L. Definitely gives a more premium feel. Also, almost zero bezels on all the three sides. The lower bezel too is quite slim. Sony branding towards the extreme left. Then right in the center is the standby light, far field mics and the light sensors for adaptive brightness. These diamond design stands might look slim and tiny for a huge TV like this, but trust me, they're pretty sturdy and provide an excellent grip on the table. The distance between the two stands is 42 inches. Might be helpful if you're planning to table mount the TV. Moving towards the back, so it comes with this lovely grid texture design and the back is made of polycarbonate. You can spot the Bravia branding on the extreme top right, power input port is on the extreme left, while all the rest of the ports are on the right for easy access even when the TV is wall mounted. Dual USB-A ports, one USB 2 and the blue one is USB 3. Optical, headphone jack, AV input, two HDMI 2.0 ports, two HDMI 2.1 ports, LAN Ethernet and antenna. So, HDMI 1 and 2 ports support 4K at 60Hz, while HDMI 3 and 4 support 4K at 120Hz. So if you want to connect a setup box, then ideally use the HDMI 1 or 2 port. If you want to connect a gaming console like PS5, then use the HDMI 3 or 4 port. 
The HDMI 3 port also supports eARC, so you can use it to connect it to soundbars or home theater system for digital audio output. Also keep in mind, it has eARC support, so Dolby Atmos pass-through will work like a breeze. Let's have a quick look at the specifications. So it comes with a 4K VA panel with a resolution of 3840 by 2160 pixels, full array backlight, 120Hz refresh rate with VRR support that makes it perfect for PS5 gaming. 3GB RAM with 32GB internal storage, Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos support, 30W sound output with acoustic multi-audio and it's running Google TV OS. Alright, before we talk about the display and its experience, I want to spread some light on the technology behind this panel. So, this is a full array backlight panel with 88 dimming zones. It's 50% more than the previous Sony Bravia X90K. In simple words, full array backlight TVs have better control over the individual LED zones. So what happens is that the backlight can dim or turn on and off in different zones and helps this TV achieve a better contrast in light and darker images. I hope that gives you a better idea. Now it's time to share the experience. So here is a 4K HDR video. And the first thing I can tell you is that the colors look spectacular. Vibrant and punchy when needed while still keeping it natural. All thanks to the XR Triluminous Pro, you get real greens, vibrant reds and deep blues. The XR Contrast Booster makes sure the images look vibrant and super eye-catchy. However, the real magic happens with dark scenes. Blacks are pitch perfect, while the rest of the details absolutely stand out. Now there will always be a stark difference in contrast levels and colors of a regular TV and a full array backlight TV with local dimming like this. True blacks are achieved with vibrant colors in the same frame. Movie buffs are absolutely going to love it. Now this is one of my favorite scenes from The Dark Knight. Check out the blacks, pitch black, and the contrast levels are mind numbing. We run some tests to check for blooming and light trails. The white box remains really well lit and bright, keeping most of the screen completely black. Though sometimes slight blooming can be noticed, but it's almost negligible. You don't see it unless you're pixel peeping. Here's another one. Whites are super bright, while blacks are perfectly black. Full array backlight with local dimming at its best. When it comes to brightness, Sony doesn't officially share the numbers and neither would I use a lux meter to give you fake numbers. I know a lot of people do that, but that's not a way to check a TV's brightness. You can Google it if you don't believe me. But what I can tell you is that it's definitely brighter than the previous X90K. The best part to test for brightness is an HDR video, where each detail stands out and the brightness is something you don't have to worry one bit. It's a full array backlight panel for God's sake. You can't get better than this. The TV also comes with Dolby Vision support and you can find tons of content on Netflix and you can spot the logo on some of the supported content. True Dolby Vision needs really bright panel and here you can see this looks outstanding. Also worth mentioning, the X90L comes with Netflix calibrated mode, which enhances the content for the viewer as the movie maker intended it to be seen. If you are a Netflix fan, this TV is for you. The cognitive processor XR enables this TV to reproduce pictures and sound in the same way that humans see and hear them in real world. It's working on every image and scene in the background, truly elevating the experience. Then there's this new display feature on the X90L called XR Clear Image. It does what the name says, reduce noise and blur to bring more clarity to the image. Especially noticeable when you see a new scroller at the bottom of the screen, which mostly feels very choppy, but now it's gonna be smooth scrolling all the way. Then there's XR Motion Clarity, which is basically MEMC, and Sony has perfected it over the years. It basically adds frame in between fast moving scenes, making it feel even more real. Ideal while you're watching your favorite match, it makes the experience so lifelike. Especially want to talk about the upscaling and the best way to test that is setup box. It literally makes even the most basic content feel like 4K. Excellent noise reduction and clarity makes the viewing experience even better. Let's come to the part that we've all been waiting for, PS5 game. So once PS5 is connected to the Bravia TV, it automatically enters gaming mode, basically enabling ALLM to reduce input lag. There you go, we are set up on the home page. The fluidity itself will make your jaw drop. Now before we get to the gaming part, you need to know why the X90L is perfect for PS5. Firstly, hardware-wise, 
HDMI 2.1, 120 Hz refresh rate, VRR and ALLM support. All together making it a dream combo for gaming. Then software wise there is this new gaming menu. It helps you toggle VRR on and off directly from here. Further you can adjust motion blur and that will work only when VRR is turned off. Then black equalizer makes scenes brighter, especially helpful when you're playing in a dark environment. Easier to spot your enemies. Then crosshair enables a cross or a dot in the center, helpful to aim better and quicker. Of course, you can also change the crosshair type from cross to dot and even the color. Especially worth mentioning, this gaming menu will only pop up if a PS5 is connected and not any other gaming console. Then there's also HDR tone mapping feature which enhances every detail in high contrast scenes. Alright, it's time to unleash the beast. And we're starting with Spider-Man Miles Morales. Now this is playing at full 4K and what an amazing experience this is. Every pixel carries so much detail, making the images so much more crisper. The gameplay is just awesome, super smooth and absolutely no lag. It's like they designed a console that has so much power that it's able to handle even the most complex graphics with so much ease. Here's my favorite game, Uncharted. Though this is an old game, but it has been remastered for PS5, bringing so much more detail, more frames and smoothness to the gameplay. It's an absolute delight. Trust me, you can't stop playing for hours. Every detail just stands out. The DualSense controller is a state-of-art device. The controls are very responsive as you can expect, but the best part is it comes with vibration support. Every subtle jerk or punch will give you a feedback, making it super immersive. There's also a speaker and mic on the controller, and of course this top section is a proper pad where you can type or tap. It's so cool. Just when you think this can't get better, there's adaptive triggers. What it essentially does is, applies different levels of resistance depending on the gameplay. My god, it's like you're in the game itself. For more games you can download from the store. Trust me, there's a huge collection of every popular game that you can think of. And above that is the PlayStation Plus. This is a subscription program where you can pay according to the plan you choose and play almost unlimited games. Truly a game changer. So you don't need to buy every game, you can test them here, play them here, just subscribe and enjoy the huge collection. The X90L and the PlayStation 5 go hand in hand and work best when paired together. Fans of OLED TVs can definitely consider the Sony Bravia A80L, which also by the way I reviewed very recently. It also comes with 120Hz refresh rate, VRR, ALLM, gaming menu, HDR tone mapping and will also provide the exactly same experience that you see here. I'll link that video in the description, if you like to see that, you should definitely check it out. Alright, coming back to the TV. So, it's running the Google TV OS, very colourful and vibrant, some popular apps already come pre-installed, Netflix, Prime Videos, YouTube and more. The interface is extremely well optimised. You know, I have to talk about this now. A lot of people ask me why Sony TVs are priced higher than budget TVs. Same hi to hai sab. Bhai, same nahi hota. Use karo ki to pata chalega how swiftly and smoothly everything works on a Sony TV. And that's what you're paying for. The amazing experience. That flawless, non-jittery, no errors, no bugs. It just works really well. Then in the settings, you can adjust picture settings where you can make adjustments to the color, brightness, motion smoothing and more. If you go to the storage, we have 20 GB of usable space and about 17 GB free, which is more than enough to install apps and games. If you go to the app section, you can install all the popular OTT apps and games. There is a huge collection of everything that you need. Talking about the Bravia Core app that comes pre-installed on the X90L. It's a Sony movie streaming app where you find a decent collection of movies that are absolutely free to stream. The best part is this app has the largest collection of IMAX enhanced movies. Check this out and this viewing experience is totally next level. Firstly, the aspect ratio goes edge to edge, almost eliminating the black bars on the top and bottom. It gives you so much more detail than regular formats. True benefit of IMAX. Plus, added support for Dolby Atmos, the audio and video experience coming together are truly jaw-dropping. 
though most of the content is free there are some premium contents that will need coupons to watch we get five coupons that come free and you can redeem them as of now there is no subscription plan announced so make the best of it as long it's all available fans of mirroring the x90l has support for apple airplay so you can mirror your iphone your ipad or mac wirelessly the overall experience was very very good not even a hint of lag in fact, we even mirrored a YouTube video from our phone and it played flawlessly. Then it also comes in hands-free Google Voice Assistant. All you need to say is OK Google. And you can ask it for the weather, ask it to adjust the volume. You can ask it for general trivia questions and even ask it to launch apps. The list is endless. Basically, use your TV hands-free. Of course, if you don't want to use this feature, you can turn off the Farfield mics from the button below. Similarly, it also comes with Alexa support. Once again, once set up, you can use your Alexa speaker to voice control the TV as well. All right, coming to the sound. Well, it comes with 30 watt sound output, which Sony calls acoustic multi audio. There are two side mounted sound positioning tweeters and X balance double bass reflex down firing speakers. Also, during the setup, the TV runs an acoustic sound test to know your settings and the room to enhance the audio experience. All right, enough info, time for a quick demo. So, Sony has been a pioneer in the audio department and the X90L's audio management is stellar. If I would verbally tell anyone just 30 watt sound output, they would assume that's not too much. But trust me, the experience will put most soundbars to shame. The side tweeters and the downfiring speakers collaborate to give you extremely rich sound. It's superbly tuned and adjusts according to the content you're watching. Good bass, impressive instrument separation and crystal clear vocals. Of course, if you really want to take it to the next level, I suggest you get a soundbar. I'll link a few Sony soundbars with Dolby Atmos support in the description. If you'd like to buy one, you should definitely check it out. To quickly summarize, it also comes with Bravia Cam support, which helps for better optimization of picture and audio once it knows where you're seated. You can also have gesture control and of course, you can also use it for video calls with your friends and family. You can buy the Bravia Cam for just $7,999 if you buy it with this TV. So, the X90L is a complete package. And even more ideal if you own a PS5. If not and considering to buy one, then these two are an absolutely lethal combo. There is a flat 4000 instant discount and up to 20,000 cashback depending on the card and EMIs that you choose. I got a 4000 instant plus 7500 cashback with my 55 inch X90L. Talking about the pricing of the TV, firstly it's available in three sizes, 55 inch, 65 inch and 75 inch. You can see the prices here. They might slightly vary on Amazon, which you should check out. I'll share the links for all the sizes in the description. If you'd like to buy one, you should definitely check it out. So this was it guys. I hope this video was helpful. If there are any questions, make sure you put them down in the comments below and I'll definitely answer them all. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Until next time. Cheers.